Hey, what up? This is your boy, The Solo Traveler RID, and thanks again for checking out another one of my videos. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and to hit that bell while you're here. So, the president of Colombia has spoke out <clears throat> just recently about sex tourism in Colombia, especially in, in Cartagena. So, he's basically uh, stated that there will be some problems for people who are basically who get caught up in sex crimes in Cartagena, um, or, or just, I think just in general, whatever going on in the wall city. So it looks like they're looking to double down. They usually do this around this time. Uh, roughly you'll see news reported by him talking about this. So, uh, just want to just let you guys be on alert just to, so that you guys don't get caught up in any situation. You never know what's going on. And of course, you know, people could, um, you know, force you into something that you don't want to do. So just want to put that out there that this is what's going on around the, the wall city and to be careful. So. Like I said, this is what the Colombian president has stated. So I'm going to jump into the article to give you guys more information about this. So let's go ahead and take a look to see what's going on. So here's the article. This is actually from today, um, November 21st, 2021. This is from El Colombiano. It says, they will declare unpleasant people to those who seek sex tourism in Cartagena. It says here, as people undesirable will be declared those who are caught in Cartagena looking for sex tourism, said Saturday, President Ivan, during the launch of an uh, offensive um, against sexual exploitation in the city of, of the Colombian Caribbean coast. Tourism who intend to fall into any of these practices in this country will not only be deported, but will be declared personal non grata. And of course, before before the commission of any crime, the respect of, the respect of prosecution will be carried out," said the president. The so-called Christmas security plan implies the arrival of 50 additional police officers and 10 of the judicial investigators, who will be in charge of monitoring and prosecuting those involved in sexual crimes in Cartagena. Also says here. The, the control appears hotels establishments and and especially in the clock tower one of the best known entrances to the wall city where sexual tourism is reported from the early early hours of the day will also be straight uh, strengthened <clears throat> defense minister diego said that three critical points were identified within the wall city where sex tourism has been identified and that they will be monitored by authorities this also implies a special effort with the attorney general office in the police with the most wanted in this type of crime as well as contribution from the ministry of, of the interior of strengthening the mobility of the tourist police in the city he said defense ministry who accompanied and, and launch of this uh, strategy so there you go that's what's going on so they're basically you know going after those people that are actually looking for um you know sex tourism and, and all that stuff so you know, like I said, be on the lookout just in case, because this is another way for police officers to find a way to just mess with you in general. If they see you just hanging out alone, whatever, you never know what may happen because we know Colombia might be, a, you know, it, well, not might. We know Colombia is a great place. However, you know, we know that police officers, you know, they're going to ask you for some money and, you know, for, for certain situations, you know, for bribes. And of course, you know, best to just pay them just in case if you find yourself in a bad situation. So, um, that's just one of the things, because like I said, you know, you'd be doing nothing and you don't want the situation to happen. And, you know, like I said, cause you know, the wall city is very, is, is a big popular, uh, popular tourist destination to go take a look at during the day and at night. And you just don't want to get caught up because of what they're trying to do the police officers and so forth. So, but nonetheless, I just want to report this, what is going on, you know, take it as be. So, this is your boy, the Solo Traveler ORD. Thanks again for checking out the video. Of course, like I said, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Hit that bell, and I'm out.